This is an incredible view. We're here with Sail Trilogy going on what's gonna be the most beautiful snorkel adventure along the coast of Maui. We're starting out here in the Lahaina Historic Harbor District and it is a beautiful, beautiful morning. We're sitting up here with the captain for now showing you this incredible sunrise and this weather is magical and we're gonna have a magical time in the water, sailing, on the boat. Let's do this. Good morning. Hey, brother. How are you? Good, man. What's your name? I'm Mark. What's brother your Mark name? Turtle. Hi, Turtle. What are we Yay. serving up this morning? A little pineapple ginger ale, kind of like sweet and settles wow. your... Settles the stomach, stomach before the sail? Get you going in the morning. Excellent, my brother, friend. Thank you. Out. Cheers. Thank you. Aloha. Aloha. How cool is that? What a warm welcome here with Sail Trilogy. This is awesome. Aloha, turtle. Delicious. Want some? That's right. <laughs> Let's go. This would be the best job to have, like, ever. Every morning to do this. Right? It's incredible. You're on a boat in Maui, my friend. Right? It doesn't get any better than that. No, it does not. And the sail is off to a great start because this is the most awesome catamaran and the music is killer. So we are rocking it out and uh, checking out our day with Sail Trilogy. We both love sailing. And? And snorkeling? Oh yeah. yeah! If I don't get stung by a jellyfish. Oh my god. Pushing you in. <laughs> That's going to be fun. Yeah, get in there. All of a sudden, I was completely distracted from the ocean by the smell and look of those incredible cinnamon buns. This is a breakfast. in our catamaran adventure. So what a great start to the mornings. Well, welcome to Maui. Uh, it's one of the epicenters uh, for the North Pacific humpback whales to come and mate and give birth. This is like the bedroom. This is where the magic happens, guys. So where do these whales come from? They're coming from Alaska or where? They're coming from Alaska, 3,000 miles uh, straight, straight up through that channel back there. Uh, it's uh, gonna take them about two months to get here traveling at about three to five miles an hour. Uh, they travel in what we call like a convoy. So it's just kind of like a group of whales that kind of travel together. And uh, once they arrive in uh, the Maui Nui Basin here, that's when they start showing the kind of uh, behaviors you just saw 
uh, the tail slapping and the peck slapping and the spy hopping and the breaching and all the cool things that they'll do. Uh, but they're coming to mate? They're coming to mate. So you'll, you'll see two different groups of whales. You'll see like a competition group where you have anywhere from like two to up to, we've seen maybe up to about 20 whales competing to mate with a female. So they're pushing and shoving and like blowing oh, bubbles and getting all super aggressive with each other. And she's kind of like off to the side, maybe getting chased by all these males. And uh, ultimately she's gonna decide which male put on the best performance, but who was the most dominant. And she's gonna choose to mate with that whale is what we believe. All right guys, we are coming around the corner to some epic cliffs. This is the real deal. And when you take Sail Trilogy for the Catamaran Snorkel Cruise, this is something you're gonna see. It's breathtaking. All right guys, we have 40 minutes to snorkel here at this incredible reef here. And while snorkel gear is provided, I brought my own because I did this in Malta and I loved it. It's the combo face mask with snorkel, so everything's like covered up, just like the mask mask that we all know and love. So this is what I'm doing today. All right, so there are two, there are a couple different ways to get off the catamaran. The one is what everyone's doing back behind me, jumping, I'm gonna do that, because you know, you gotta do it for the footage. But Amy, AKA Mamacita, is <laughs> going down the stairs, which is the nice easy way to get in the water. That's most definitely the way I'm coming back up. Probably everyone is coming back up that way. Yes. Are you ready to go? I'm ready to go. Here we go. <laughs> now that is cool. <laughs> and this is Sail Trilogy, and it is awesome. All right, guys, let's go down and check this place out. That was awesome, guys. What a great place. Welcome back, Amy. <laughs> so that was pretty awesome. That was our first stop here with Sail Trilogy on our snorkel excursion. And what a great spot. Beautiful fish, beautiful reef. Uh, great start, it's awesome. So we're on our second stop here on our Sail Trilogy excursion. It's incredible. We're off the coast of Lanai, and how cool is this? Because we are now here at Sharkfin Reef, which is right behind me, and we're gonna check out the teardrop butterfly fish. And this is one of the only places in Hawaii, this area here, where you can see it. And Sail Trilogy is like one of the only companies that will take you here to see it. So how cool is that? Let's do it. Awesome. So cool. Seriously. Gonna you are going to be famous. <laughs> <laughs> Look at that, guys. That was awesome. What a cool snorkel. Number two for the day. We're heading in now for some lunch and some drinks. And that's my kind of break. Here. Right, Mark and Amy. Yeah. Debbie and Abram. Gotcha. This is really cool. So, something that Sail Trilogy does, which is, I think, um, 
really important to highlight is they do a roll call, they take everyone's names, they make sure that everyone's back on the boat after the snorkel adventure because who hasn't seen open water? Now, that is not exactly how I wanna spend my afternoon. So, very cool, totally high safety precautions, love it. Although I didn't, I didn't hear Amy, did I? <laughs> Bye, Amy. <laughs> Bye, Felicia. So one of the things I was asking Krabby, I mean Amy, <laughs> about was, you know, hey, I wanted to kind of go in without my fins, my flippers, because I just wanted to feel my feet in the water and like not have all that constriction on me. And I know they make you go faster, but she was telling me about why it's so important, so. Well, if there's really strong currents, it's a good idea to have fins. Obviously, we're going on a snorkeling tour where they're not gonna bring us with really strong currents. But I was a scuba diver for years and I once jumped in the water. When you dive, you jump in with your fins often. Sometimes you drive, jump in with them on the side. And I remember jumping in and just flying because this current was so strong. So now I always wear fins. What do you mean flying? It. Like like flying past the boat because the really? currents in the water are so strong. Yeah. Interesting. Depending where you are in the world. But that was a mistake I won't do again. So it's a good idea to snorkel with fins. And it makes you way less tired. If you're not really comfortable in the ocean, the fins help so much. Well, you heard it from Ranger Rick herself. Don't forget your fins. Yeah. And don't be the last one back to the boat either. No bueno. Today was a lot of fun. A lot of fun. Fresh air, beautiful water, great crew, killer food, amazing snorkeling. Now let's not forget the drinks, because they're coming. You Thank you. That is my kind of drink. What a way to end a trip with a Mai Tai. And it is delicious. I'm telling you, Captain Casey's rocking the music today because it is awesome. Is this all your stuff? Maybe. <laughs> that sounds like a yes. Very cool. Yes, I like music selection too. Isn't this a little young for you though? Aren't you a little young for me? Well, good thing we're not together. <laughs> or are we? <laughs> We are going to visit Raquel, who makes the meanest Mai Tai on the catamaran. That's a real Mai Tai. That is a real Mai Tai. Look at that float. Love Ooh. that. Beautiful. Cheers. Thank you, Raquel. <laughs> Cheers. Ooh. Dirty. And delicious. <laughs> now this is my kind of life. Seriously. Now we're on the roller coaster portion of the journey, which is awesome. Cruising the waves, having some drinks, taking our time, heading back to the harbor. Beautiful, beautiful day. Incredible coastline, incredible snorkeling. Just what a great experience this is. Something you have to do, and if you've never been snorkeling before, this is really the best, um, if you will, dip your toe in the water uh, type of experience. Um, very well run, and just uh, I, I really a great time. Really nice. I would highly recommend it. Check out Sail Trilogy, and when you're on Maui, it's a don't miss experience. And I just met yet another friendly face on this incredible excursion, and she is starting her own YouTube channel. What is your name? Dylan. Hi, Dylan. Hi. So tell me all about your YouTube channel. Um, I want to start a YouTube channel for kids about how to help save the planet. Well, that is quite a worthy YouTube channel. So um, tell me about that. Like, how did you get how did you get interested and passionate about all this? I want to be a marine biologist and environmental activist when I grow up. So the ocean is something that's super important to me. I also grew up in California, so I'm a surfer. I'm a scuba diver. Um, wow. And. Uh, just the, I love the outdoors and I know that I've seen so much trash around and you hear all this horrible stuff and no one's, we're doing stuff but we're not doing stuff. So it's cool, especially kids to think that they can't make a difference that they can. Well Dylan, that is awesome and we totally appreciate you raising all of our awareness to protecting the environment and maintaining this beautiful thing we call 
planet Earth. And what is the name of your channel? Do you have a name picked out yet? Yes, The Sage Planet. The Sage Planet, S-A-G-E? Yes. Awesome. So guys, trotters, give Dylan some love. Please check out The Sage Planet on YouTube. And remember to subscribe, like, comment, and share her videos. She's gonna be a winner and thank you, Dylan. Thank you so much. Thank you. Head for a sweet ending to a perfect day, a little ice cream and hot fudge. Sail Trilogy has pulled out all the stops. This has been an incredible experience. Yes, I finally got my ice cream. Finally got her ice cream. Yes. Who would have thought it would have been on the catamaran? All right, over and out, guys. Sail trilogy, gotta do it. Maui. Okay, I will admit that I did not expect that I was gonna have literally a sea urchin or uni in Japanese before we headed off to our sail trilogy adventure. But you don't get a fresher breakfast than that. They fight. Yeah, I don't know. Yeah, this one. Go for it. Holy mackerel! Look at this. Watch them attack. You see him? He's pushing this rod. What rod? Right here. Aloha, this is you called a uni in Japanese. Strong, huh? Uni, then, right. Yeah, this is the best, the most expensive sushi you can get. I, I can't push it back. Hmm? Wow. And they fight. And I just cut it out here. This is where I go. Yeah, that's surf. great in pasta or? Yeah. Yeah, he just caught them all at the same time. Are they like right up here close to the shore? Yeah. They're in the rocks. Wow. Look at before. that. Yeah. I'm gonna try? Oh, yes, no. you first. Go, 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 go. go. <laughs> Look at that. It's awesome. <laughs> Look at these guys. What, they Pretty good, you guys. You know, wow. you gotta try it. They were about to hop back in the Jeez, ocean. Now you're recording, you I gotta to try it. <laughs> yes, you must try it. <laughs> I'm gonna be going oh, on a boat. Ah, right now, I'm really struggling. <laughs> bizarre foods. Wow, I've always admired. Right? I hope you have a life with an aphrodisiac. It is an aphrodisiac, right? These are it is. gorgeous. You know what, so you caught them on the line? They're interesting. Or, no, look at them moving. Yes. They're trying to scoop back on, to the water. It. You must try it. It's salty and then sweet. Sweet meat. Have you ever ate? I like, have, but try it, man. Come like on. Cajun crabs and it's not painful, crawfish. It's not painful. I don't know it if I can. Like it tastes here. like crawdad fat and crab fat. It's good. Really? Yeah. It's really good. Don't First, be a it's boy salty about from it. the salt yeah. water, yeah, and then it's sweet. You don't eat anything. If I did it, you <laughs> must. <laughs> you must. Go on, go on, come eat, on, eat, you eat, can eat. do this. This yeah, is an experiment. Man. Experience, you probably come on. I'll I'll record you. Okay. That's right. This will be like this. <laughs> hey, there'll be a big experience. All right, guys. So tomorrow. right before my morning cruise on Trilogy, I decided to come out here to the harbor, and we got these uni, oh, right? Yeah. Uni. Uh, uni. Fresh uni. AKA uni. Bono. Yeah. Wow. I thought you got that. Am I gonna get sick? No. I just got, I had acute appendicitis and I had appendix surgery a couple of months ago. Really? Oh, man. Yeah. And that, this, Come on. The I'm appendix right. processes shellfish and all of that. If I wasn't you know, afraid, you, know, you, you cannot. This way, you I'm got to. to my... I only did it for you. And you eat the whole thing. Yes. Hey, it must. <gasps> Don't you shake nothing up. No, that's not the way. Suck them. Suck them. Do you eat clam? You have to. If I did it, my mama would be so proud. Yes. Don't be rushing, people. I don't, I don't, don't spit it out. You must initiate yourself. I'm delicious. proud of him. It's delicious. Sweet. It's good as sweet, eh? Little salty. Yes. But smooth and honestly yes. better than what I've had in the restaurants. Because this is coming like right here, right out of the water. Right? Yeah. What's your name? I'm Mark. Nice to meet you. I'm Papa. Nice to meet you guys. Nice video, my friend. Awesome. Okay, you gotta do it behind you. Ready? Yes. <laughs> awesome, guys. <laughs> Shout out to you. you Thank you guys yeah. for my breakfast. Well, that wasn't exactly the breakfast I was looking for before the sale, but it sure was pretty darn good. Yes.